What is up, YouTube? What is up, family? We have another Patreon request, and guess what? We got some pentatonics. Yes, we're gonna start, I guess, this PTX PT experience. I guess is how you would actually say it. PT experience. I don't know. Anyway, the World Tour 2019 Episode Zero. Let's check it out. No idea what we're about. Oh, well, I have done a couple of these. I think I did do like one or two. But apparently you guys were like, there's way more. So, so let's check it out. That's my warm up. <laughs> Kevin, Kevin, Kevin. Things are oh. great. We're really busy. We're doing a bunch of writing, writing for a new original album. And it's all really exciting. It said turn left, but can it? Yeah. The life of Scott, it's just been working. It's been Citizen Queen. I started this little kids group, Pentatonics, and writing a lot. And I've kept myself pretty busy. So I love the plan to do it like a whole time through with the boys' choir before. Yeah, That's they do cool. a, they do it. It gives it some breathing. Uh, Not bad. Not bad. Amazing. Just had such a good session. My voice is soaring today, which is always a good sign. Really, I really don't want to say where I'm going right now, but you know what? I'm going to be a, a, my most authentic self. I'm going to talk about. I'm going to talk about. I'm going to talk about. Here we are. Hi, how are you? Hi. Can I get two cheesy gordita crunches, please? Thank you. <laughs> Playing Pokemon Go. If I'm not working on one of the 4,000 projects, I'm either on my couch or at Universal City Walk playing Pokemon Go. It's, like, it's kind of nothing in between. Pokemon Go, really? Oh, all right. What's new with me? My ankle is better. Oh. Um, Obviously, last time you saw me on Christmas tour, I was rocking the knee scooter, yeah, and yeah, she yeah. has been I'm laid to rest. I also have a new member of the family. It's a flu! Oh, all right, he looks so, like the love child. So this is more of personally getting to know each member, which is great. This is, yeah, this is perfect. We need to know this. Between them, he has blue eyes and kind of tan. But he's not. He's just a little palm ski. So this is what I've also been doing. Or the only thing I've been doing. Because, um... He is equally as joyful as he is distracting. Now that we're all older and we've been writing in 900 feet, turn right. And we've been writing for other projects, like our, our voices in terms of how we write is just so much better and it's been so much easier and honestly so fun. And I feel like we're writing like really, really great stuff. We've mildly discussed, we haven't fully decided on the on the set list like for sure yet, but um, we've mildly discussed like doing some of our new originals. And I don't think they'll like officially be released then, so you'll have to come to the show to see it. Oh. I can't wink at the camera, I tried. I'm a bad winker. We are at uh, this really, really nice place. It's really hard to get a reservation. Like, you have to make it, like, weeks in advance. It's called uh, Taco Bell. <laughs> I'm starting to get a trend. I'm starting to feel a trend here with PTX. So that's two. And um, I'm here as a reward to myself because I felt like the session was great. And I'm super excited to hear it all come together. And um, I know Scott got Taco Bell yesterday and it sounded really amazing and so we're getting it again. Taco Bell is good, I'm not gonna lie. They're good. Good stuff. And not that fast. Not that fast. Oh, it's going. Oh, no more on Mitch. Welcome to my wardrobe. He said it's oh, going. I have to get dressed for this day because I love to turn out a look. Even if I'm just going to the studio, it's always kind of fun to put something together and kind of feel good about yourself. That way you get into the mindset, you start feeling good, you start feeling confident, you start singing your best. But take a look around. Anything you see is yours. <laughs> no, I need it. I need it. <laughs> mm. 
Jesus Christ, that's a that's a that's a hefty amount of clothes. <laughs> All uh, oversized suits is my guess. I'm just messing with you, Mitch. I'm just messing with you. Yeah, it's actually very cool that you get to see my process and kind of see how I, I take one piece and I start from scratch and just start kind of building from there. Fashion is all about construction. You know, what What do you want to say? It's it, You're telling a story, basically. Um, and your story... Your story is important. Fashion's important. Clothes are important. The way you look is the only thing that matters, and that's what I'm trying to get across. It doesn't matter if you're nice, it doesn't matter if you're successful. If you look good, you will be successful. Do you know what I mean? You always... He... he f <laughs> that is hilarious. I was actually... I was gonna interrupt him and went, Hmm, Mitch, uh... You might piss off a few people with those comments. And then... He, they must have figured that out. Good. You will be successful. And then, Do you know what I mean? They put that in there. Mm-hmm. You always choose the Harley. It's always a safe bet. You put the vintage tee on, you put some denims on. It's go time, baby. Maybe a hat. Don't look. <laughs> What I'm thinking is, what the hell, Mitch, you lucky, mm, what a view. An all black look. Oh my God, seriously? That's what you, that's what you chose? Yeah, all black, it's easy. Studio outfit, here we go, gotta go. Simple, don't take the focus away from the music is kind of what this is saying. You look good, but not too good. I've been good. I've just been working on my own music. That's been really incredible. It's been kind of terrifying, but it's been uh, really eye-opening and really thrilling, and I'm excited. Mitch with the, Mitch with the Tesla. Look at him. To take that further. And we've also been doing songwriting sessions with Pentatonix, and they've been going so fabulously. I, I just feel like we're all in this really, really good, healthy mental, mental state and we're all really excited about life and about music again, and it's really beautiful. So I think that's reflecting in the songs that we're writing. I'm really excited for people to hear it. So it feels, um, the songs feel really elevated. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right, Matt, Matt. Time for Matt. This is my car, her name is Rose. The car's name is Rose? Oh. Oh, hey, guys. Oh, oh, we got some Tesla fans here. I didn't know this. It's just Matt here. Getting Rose washed. Getting Rose washed. Wait, can you get a slow motion? Let me get up. <laughs> it's the one and only Eagle Devil Bunny. <laughs> they could definitely take good care of you. You'll be all right. Okay, I'll be right back. All right. No, stop crying. Stop crying. Stop crying. It's been really relaxing. It's been really relaxing. But at the same time, no Taco Bell for Matt. A lot of stuff has been going on. I've been doing a lot of uh, uh, singing at my church. We were doing a lot. We were doing the album. So it's it's been a lot I mean, of. This is five work. years. <laughs> and um, started the gym thing pretty seriously. And uh, drinking a lot more water. Yeah. And that's good. Oh yeah, we went to the Grammys. I went to my first Grammys ever. So cool. Oh, I know this guy. Woo! Come with me, catch a rare type specimen. Cut a lot with the hesitant skeleton. We'll break up fast with fruit. How cool is that though? That you could get in a car and look up your music and then play it and hear yourself you ever think of that that's got to be the coolest thing i think i'm gonna listen to me btx we've been doing a lot of writing and recording um original music which is really cool for me because i love the original album that they did before 
And so to be able to be a part of that process and add my, my style and my, like my vibe on it is really cool. And I mean, we're gonna have to start getting ready for tour. The staging is bigger and better. We have some crazy um, surprises with the, with the set design and um, it's all gonna be just really, really cool. Right here. Oh my god. I'm just wondering, is every single one like this where we're gonna like see parts of each member and what they're doing? Because that's I like this. I'm ready to go. What, how, how many are there? 50? We're doing it if that's what you know each one's experience. All right, I think I get it. I like it. I like the idea. Gosh, y'all, this is one of our favorite things for Lee and I to get acai bowls. Just look at this. I mean, it just looks like gunk right now. <laughs> <laughs> but I promise you, it was It looked blueberry. pretty before. It looked pretty before. Yeah, it's like one of our favorite activities to do. Oh my gosh, 100%. Just come to the beach, hang out, be together. Oh my gosh, this love is in the air. Wait, I gotta, can I, can I address it's something? It's really mushy. So, all last PT experience, y'all. You never, ever, ever, ever saw this girl, this wonderful, wonderful girl, in any of the videos. This is because we were trying to keep our relationship on the down low. So I was usually standing next to Ben, <laughs> out of the shot. But it's cool now, that because you know we are engaged. It's been an amazing time. Yeah. Actually, wait, turn around. I want oh, to see yeah. this. She just got this made. <laughs> so if you guys see a girl wearing this during tour, you know who she is. Now you'll know. <laughs> now you'll know. Right now we're going to the studio. Uh, we're working on a new piece that we're excited to perform on tour. Can't tell you what it is yet. It's been so fun getting into the stu studio and- Uh, I mean, we got some serious Tesla fans here. I did not know this part about PTX. My goodness. We got three members with Teslas. And just working on new tracks for- I think one bought one and showed it to the other one. And he went, oh, I want one. And then the other one went, Oh, that looks, I want one too. And that's how that happens. That's how that works. It's been so fun getting into the studio and just working on new tracks for this upcoming tour. I mean, this is the biggest tour we have ever done. I mean, we are doing some of the biggest and greatest arenas in the United States. I mean, the fact that we're doing MSG still gives me chills. Like I've always wanted to, I've never even seen a concert at Madison Square Garden. So let alone the first wow. time I get to step foot in Madison Square Garden is when I'm performing it, is the craziest feeling in the entire world. Um, and then the Forum in Los Angeles. So it, it, it is such um, a magnificent feeling to know that we're about to perform all these new songs for fans. Um, and we're working hard to deliver because we really want to just create an amazing experience for all you guys. It's, it should be really, really fun. <laughs> Where did that come from? That was a, it sounded like a, uh, a window. Okay, well, uh, there you go. There you go. See, I learn something every damn day with this uh, with this group here. Now I uh, we got some Tesla lovers in the house. I did not know that. I am one as well. Uh, just wish they had more range. That's all my only complaint. Just more range, you know? And make them cheaper. Just make them a little cheaper, you know? So everybody can drive them. Well, they have gotten cheaper. I shouldn't even say that. They were really outrageous in the beginning. But anyway, it doesn't matter. Uh, see, that's something I learned. We got three Tesla drivers in PTX. Um, they like Taco Bell. Learn that too. Uh, the rest I know. You know, they work their ass off. They produce and produce and produce. And uh, they're perfect. But it is still pretty cool. Like, hey, I'm getting in the car. What should I play? <gasps> I'm going to play myself. That's pretty cool, really. If you think about it, that's pretty damn cool. But there you have it. All right. No, very cool. So we're a little behind. It's only five years. Five years. What's five years? <laughs> anyway, so we're a little behind, but we'll see where this takes us. We're, I got to, you know, there's another one to do. Patreon wanted to do two of these. And then I assume this is going to just cascade into 
number three, number four, number five, episode one, two, three, you know what I mean? And we're just going to go from there and we'll have fun. And I will probably definitely learn more about each individual. By the way, when Kirsty is uh, all over the place, because these are some busy little bees, they're all over the place. Who's taking care of all those dogs? You know, that's a pain in the neck when you got all these dogs in the house and you like, like we even have this problem. We got two dogs and two cats and it's like, well, we want to go to vacation for a week. Well, how do we go on vacation for a week? One of my dogs is old. Can barely get up. Needs help getting up. She's getting old. Poor little thing. Well, she's not little. She's a 13-year-old Sheltie. Her knees. She got bad knees. So, you know, we can't even, like, it's it's rough for me to even get, like, a family member to say, hey, can you, uh, can you help out? Just a week while we're gone, and you know, take them out, let them crap, let them piss, do you know, feed them. It's a lot of work. So, how the hell is Kirsty doing it? Or maybe her boyfriend's just at home taking care of all the dogs. Maybe that's his job. There you go. Maybe that's it. So, I don't have that pleasure because you want to actually go on vacation, you know, with the person you're with, not leave them home with the animals. Anyway, you know what I'm trying to say? Okay, good. Anyway, PT Experience, Episode Zero. Take care. Peace out. Have a good night.